A new Marvel Studios series about a deaf indigenous superhero is making waves. The show is called Echo, and there's a Manitoba connection. Katarina Zervogel is an Anishinaabe Mohawk and German actor from Seguin First Nation. She plays Taloa, the mother of one of the lead characters, Maya Lopez. Zervogel spoke to CBC through an interpreter about her journey and celebrity status. <laughs> I feel like it's a bit of a no-brainer, the fact that the character itself is Indigenous and deaf, and that, that is who I am. I always have. Oh, it means a ton to me. I mean, to have deaf representation, Indigenous representation, but also having those both communities and worlds within one series is an incredible opportunity it hasn't happened and i'm just amazed and proud to be a part of that it was a heavy responsibility right having deaf indigenous representation and i'm just incredibly proud to be involved with alacqua cox as well so not having to carry all of that load by myself right there were multiple people and we wanted to make sure that our representation was authentic to the community and to the indigenous individuals that were involved in the show. The deaf writers, everybody who was a part of the production put into a solid effort into making sure that everything worked together and there was a huge amount of teamwork, right? Because we, they wanted to ensure that the representation was authentic. I think Paramount was just hiring Indigenous actors and people behind the scenes, right? You had to have those voices there um, from lived experiences. And so having the communities, whether that be somebody who is deaf or Indigenous, that's not always the case. And so they provide authentic stories because they've lived those experiences. I think a huge part of it was just doing it, right? Tons of rehearsal time, tons of you know, working on the script, working on my lines every evening, watching videos. I had an ASL coach that we worked together with the videos, making sure that I was able to memorize the lines, you know, to the best of my ability, making sure I understood the intention, um, making sure that I was using the signs they wanted to do and making sure that it fit with their process as well. I wanted to make sure that it was natural and make sure that it was fluid. So it's, I wanted, to, those I think were the pieces that really helped me to overcome the challenge. 